30. Turning to weather now, it's been a bit cloudy this morning, but quiet out there so far. Meteorologist Larissa Bay is tracking the end of our work week with the return of some showers. Larissa, a lot of people are going to be in town for the regatta tomorrow, so we're hoping that it's not too bad. A lot of people will be in town tonight for the Sixers game, tomorrow for the regatta. The good news is, is that it's not going to be an overly wet several days. We're not talking the type of rain we saw last weekend, but unfortunately, it is the same system that's just two hours south that will finally begin to die out. But once it continues to move further west, it will be spreading in some moisture, and that unfortunately folds for us tomorrow. Right now we are dealing with the clouds. In fact, we take a live look outside. Those clouds have been able to break in some spots, but if you find yourself along the shore, that's where it's been cloudy over the last several hours. And unfortunately, they're going to be socked in cloud cover for the rest of the day with a few more breaks in that cloud deck right over the city and even nicer as we head further north and west. Temperatures outside of the door right now are sitting at 69 degrees. The mercury will continue to rise here. Visibility is looking good. Winds are out of the east coming in at 10 miles an hour. And with uh, that wind still prevalent, I'm sure it's blowing around some pollen. And if your triggers are trees and grass, just note that they are high. Weeds and mold remain moderate. So if these are your triggers, just make sure you take your meds. But here's some good news. We will see some relief as far as allergy, as far as the pollen is concerned. And that comes with the rain. So we'll get to that in a moment tonight. Mostly cloudy and mild with temperatures taking a tumble to around 57 degrees. We will see areas of patchy fog develop. That's probably going to be problematic as we head towards tomorrow morning. So it's something we'll be watching closely for you. Otherwise, winds will calm down and they'll shift out of the east. Notice what's happening outside of the door. We're nice and quiet here. Clouds build tonight, and then we have the showers moving through the region here. This is Friday morning, 9.30 in the morning. You'll probably want an umbrella on your way out the door, but the good news is it's not an all-day rain, and it's not widespread rain. We have a better shot of rain come Saturday, also not an all-day rain event. This is 10 a.m., and you can see some pretty hefty storms and, and heavy rain out towards our southern neighborhoods. This will lift, and then it'll turn pretty scattered as we head toward the afternoon. So once again, not an all day rain, the best chance of rain Saturday comes Saturday morning. This is what the next seven days look like. I am keeping the chance for a shower or a storm on Sunday. Notice those temperatures. It's going to be quite mild, warm, 80 degrees, 82 on Monday with a better shot of rain and storms. And then we're back to near normal for Tuesday. We'll be right back.